Hey guys, a quick little note on processed foods. So typically when we think of processed foods, we think of unhealthy, you know, highly refined white flour, processed, you know, cookies, donuts, cakes, whatever it is. So we're going to take that a step further and think about processed foods as literally how the food is processed. So it could be a quote unquote healthy food, but how that food how we purchase it essentially. So if you look at something like a juice, um, like an orange juice, it could be, you know, 100% freshly squeezed, organic, you know, no pesticides, all that sort of stuff. Um, it could be all those things, but if it's in this, this bottle form where we can just pour it into a glass and drink this juice down, as opposed to eating that many oranges, that would have yielded that juice. So let's say it's a big glass of orange juice, it's gonna yield, it's um, yielded from 10 oranges. When was the last time you sat down and ate 10 oranges? It's, it's pretty tough to do, I mean it's possible, it's doable, but highly unlikely that we're gonna do that. So thinking about what forms we're consuming these foods in, whether they're quote unquote healthy or not. So nut butter is another example, is that we can just kind of scoop nut butter into our mouths without even chewing the stuff, it's already broken down. Coconut milk or coconut products is another example. Instead of having to, you know, crack a coconut open, scoop out the meat, drink drink the, uh, the coconut water, um, we can just, you know, pour coconut milk, full fat coconut milk into, you know, a curry or a glass or a shake or whatever it may be. So just thinking about scoping out a little bit, taking a step back and thinking about how we're consuming these foods, whether they're quote unquote healthy or not, and how they're processed and what, how they're brought to market and how we're consuming them. So um, this can be kind of widespread among or among a bunch of other foods as well. I'm just gonna to touch on those guys today, but just something to think about. So um, yeah, if you have any questions about that or any questions for future Q&As, hit me up and hope you learned something. See you guys, bye.